guys okay so it's the night before my 30th birthday i'm very excited i had to show you okay so we know i didn't go out and like buy a whole outfit because it's me i had to buy a bag but i had to do one more thing a little bit special i braided pearls and rhinestone you guys into my hair and i'm fully fully obsessed and like i'm just you know i love this last year the long ponytail braid was my thing and this year it's pearl i'm gonna show you a full body outfit look but literally i'm wearing guys i swear to you this is like a beach cover-up that i'm kind of obsessed with that's floor length and then i had to wear every single birthday i have to wear my aunt's vintage donna karen necklace my normal rings on both sides and i have not been wearing earrings but i put on my original ear cuff and then some little earrings you guys i have to show you i bawled like a baby this morning my mom got me this beautiful arrangement it's anthuriums and lilies representing my aunt and i'm just like i really cried i cried like a baby for like an hour i think we all just have to have like one good birthday cry and i wasn't i don't know i just wasn't expecting these and it's like my entire collection was based off of this exact concept and so waking up to these this morning yeah it did me in look at how beautiful the pink anthuriums you guys i had red anthuriums the other week and the lilies are gonna bloom but look at the ones that already are blooming and like my entire apartment smells gorgeous he knows i'm leaving my baby can always tell when i'm leaving and so she's not happy about it the air conditioner is on guys it's really hot i'm so sorry but Okay, full fit. I have my Fendi Peekaboo little mini gold. If you guys didn't see, I have a full unboxing and then I just paired it. First of all, Python on Python might be a fashion crime. I don't know, but we're doing it. And then my normal all black with this floor length see-through number. I don't know, I'm very excited. And I had to just show one last look at the hair because like, Literally all I did was get strands and braid it through the braid. I attached them all onto one little jump loop, braided it through. It's a jewelry and hair girl's dream. Also random guys, I've been doing a lot of painting. What do we think? I'm kind of obsessed with this one. I did that one last night. This is the OG that you see all the time. Just did that one the other week. Behind the bouquet flower arrangement is my last one, which I honestly think is maybe my favorite. Have my girl, and we're off to Tao. If you guys are from New York, like Tao is like, so it's just iconic, Sex in the City, okay? Again, I said this already, but I used to go there with like the bougie Parsons kids that I went to school with, and I don't know, I had a lot of fun, and so I felt like something nostalgic, very New York for my 30th. Just kidding, I changed my shoes. That was bothering me, so I just put on Sorry about my mirror, by the way. Look at my Matisse. I love you. I'm sorry. I just put on my, <laughs> diversion. Just put on my fry boots in maroon, and I think this is perhaps better. I don't know. Then the bag is the moment, kind of. You know what I mean? And we're getting some very Beyonce wind <laughs> from the freaking air conditioner. Oh, if you're in New York, it's really hot. You already know my baby she hates it when i leave she knows i'm going to dinner oh shall we do me not show too much she knows i'm leaving i know i know are you gonna say hi to everybody you're crazy <laughs> i love you we get to hang out tonight all night <laughs> I'm hard launching this. Ah! Stay tuned for my full unboxing the medium Bottega Veneta sardine bag. You guys, I just got back. Oh, can we talk about this? Who predicted this? Who who predicted this? Because I feel like this was 
The most predictable in the best way, meaning this is just like, this is the most me bag. This is the most me bag. Look over the shoulder. Are we not like fully obsessed? It's like the perfect drop. Oh my goodness. Yep, she's gorgeous. She is absolutely gorgeous. They've just done it again. You guys will see full video, stay tuned. The birthday bags, Fendi. Python, I wore her tonight, felt like I've had her forever, love it. And the Bottega Veneta medium sardine bag. I'm absolutely obsessed, that's a ribbon, sorry. I'm fully like, can we talk about this leather? Oh my gosh, and the Python. <laughs> this is gorgeous, I just love this so much. I'm so grateful. 30, 30, 30, 30. You guys, I just couldn't be more grateful. Dinner was beautiful, Tao. Even my family said the downtown one is like a little sceny, <laughs> to be honest. But the uptown one, like, there's just something, to me, it's very nostalgic, but there's something so cool about it. I just, I highly recommend it. If you're in the city, there's some, it's like, it's cool, it's a vibe. It's not as crazy. Granted, it's a Wednesday night, so maybe on the weekends, but go on a weekday, like, the space itself, it's, I'm, I'm truly a sucker for real estate, okay? Let's be honest here. <laughs> and so, if the space is cool, then I'm probably gonna like it. And it's the best pad thai. It's, it's such good pad thai. It's such good, like, I was like, I want green tea ice cream as my birthday dessert and I got it and I couldn't be happier. Thank you guys for joining. It's very late. So it's almost my actual birthday. I'm gonna go to sleep and then I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning. It's my birthday today. Again, you guys, I'm not normally like this, but just a de decade birthday. Decade birthday, that's all I can say. I'm heading to Bergdorf's. I know I talk about it all the time, but I feel her a lot during my birthday. My aunt and I spent every single birthday there. Our birthdays were like just two weeks apart and so my mommy and I are going to Bergdorf's to have lunch, maybe do a little shopping. I'll show you what's new, a quick little outfit pick and you guys are gonna die at the surprise that I have for you that I'm going to pick up right now. It might be a new collection. Quick outfit details, boring. Since I didn't wear snakeskin last night, I'm wearing them today. And let's talk about the elephant in the room. Oh, you guys, this was the most incredible birthday gift from my family, my parents specifically. The medium Bottega sardine bag. And can we talk about how wildly obsessed I am?
very appropriately. Ending this kind of full circle. I just finished dinner. We went to Emporio in New York City on Mott Street in Nolita, my brother and his girlfriend, Lucy. And then I just had like the very most chill hang with friends. I don't even drink, so went to a bar. Very, very, very calm. Had a nice little Diet Coke. And it was absolutely lovely. I thought I'd end you guys off here. I, oh my gosh, like there's gonna be an entire video, so don't even worry, but the best part, one of the best parts about today was that I picked up my Venus collection pieces and you guys, I'm sorry if they're all tangled, but like, can we talk about this? This is the baby, AKA the small. This is the large. And then the medium, oh my goodness. All in 14 karat, of course, as always. There's gonna be more information, but the Venus collection is so obviously, we know me, okay? Champion for women, inclusivity, body diversity, these figures, the pieces that I've made are based off of figures that are like anywhere between 30 and 50,000 years old that were worshipped. And I'm now going into a whole thing, but you have no idea. I'm just like, I'm honored to be making them and to celebrate us and to be celebrated. And it's just like, it's such a blessing. So I honestly, I'm so grateful to be able to show them and a whole video is coming up soon, but there you go. I'll give you some close-ups of my little stack. Again, little small. This is the Venus of Willendorf. And then this is just like, can we talk about how, how obsessed I am? I'm fully obsessed. And then I did an even longer braid today, <laughs> which I then just added in my little pearls. Honestly, it was like way easier than I thought it was gonna be. So I will definitely be rocking this again. And you guys, I don't know if this is like only my style and it's kind of weird, but I love Meredith Duxbury. I think that she's given like some of the best advice. <laughs> I don't know if her makeup technique is like kind of weird and definitely not for me, the girl who doesn't even wear foundation, but she uses Carol Beige by Gucci, which I've been using on my lips. And then on top of it, I put Anastasia Beverly Hills Honey Kiss. Hi, I remember the name. And I've been loving this lip combo. I'm very curious to hear what we think. And then lastly, I haven't yet used my Benedetta Brusice bag and tonight was the night. She was busted out for 30. Oh, my baby's here. I'm gonna show you my little angel in a second. <laughs> but Benedetta Brusice, perfect 30 bag. This was the time to take her out. And now I get to spend the night with my baby. <laughs> Look at that face. Can we talk about a more sweet face? Like this is my angel on this earth, my angel. And at least I can still carry my baby. I love you. <laughs> and at the end of the day, buy yourself flowers. Okay, buy yourself flowers. The anthems are for my mommy. But the orchids, I saw them and I said, oh my goodness. Next to my little candle. <laughs> you guys, I'm so corny, but how beautiful are these weird, gorgeous flowers?